Hi there. In this video, I'm going to show you how you can customize the call to action section. So let's get started. First of all, let's import the block from template library and in the category, go to the call to action. And here are two blocks as of now. You can get multiple block options in the premium version. But for now, let's insert the first one. Update it. And check the page. This is default call to action design. You can make changes to this text and button as per your preferences. Let's go to the page. Scroll down and let's go to the setting. And in the general tab, as always, there are two options, block title and block items. For now, we don't need block title, so I just keep this off. And in the block items, here are different template designs. You can choose either center, left or right. For now, I just keep center. And here are three options that you can turn off or turn on. You can use it according to your design. And I'm going to change the text here. We can also change the button label here and also change the icon like this. Let's change the color of this title. And also I want to change the typography. I want to change the description text to black. You always keep the tag as a paragraph for all the description for your website. This is recommended. Once you are satisfied with the design, update it. And let's view the page. This is our call to action that we have recently designed. It's cool, isn't it? For more tutorial about Gutenberg and the WordPress, subscribe to our channel. And I will see you in the next video.